Sugar Ray Robinson might be the greatest fighter of all time. A lot of people feel he is. Because of his talents, his abilities, his consistency, 200 fights, we're never gonna have an era like that again. Miami started wearing, you know, the same kind of stuff and he wanted to dance like, uh, like Sugar Ray. And he would say it a lot when he's training. Pound for pound. When they say Sugar Ray Robinson was the greatest fighter pound for pound, I would have to admit. I would have to say yes. That man was beautiful. Timing, speed, reflexes, rhythm, every body, everything was beautiful. You know, my name not being uh, originally Robinson, my name really being Walter Smith, I changed my name, rather I borrowed a friend of mine's birth certificate, who was Ray Robinson, in order to obtain a boxing license. And I started fighting as an amateur under the name of Ray Robinson. And thanks to God, I was very successful in popularizing his name and I had to keep it. You know what you didn't want to be around back in those days with Sugar Ray Robinson? You didn't want to be the guy who beat him and is fighting him in the rematch. That's one of the reasons he was great. Because if you were lucky enough, and very few people beat him, but if you were fortunate enough, good enough, whatever, to beat him. Well, in the rematch, you usually get... Tremendous left foot now to Robinson and both his down on his back again, very much like in the last fight. When he won the world middleweight title, five times. Sugar Ray Robinson, pound for pound, the greatest fighter of all time. Better great big grizzly bear. 